Okay, here's the uh, turnips, carrots, and radishes. Turnips, carrots, radishes. I uh, had the same thing in this bed last year. Uh, I think I flipped the order, I changed the order in some way. But uh, they're doing awesome here. Uh, it's about time to harvest this, these radishes. You can see they're getting pretty big down there. But uh, we can turn up greens here. Then this bed up here last year was tomatoes. But I uh, planted some more turnips here. And uh, they're coming up quite well. But uh, that's the turnips, radishes, and carrots. Blueberries. This is a new blueberry here. We just planted that this year. Another blueberry from last year. Basil, basil, thyme. There's some sage. Mint, more basil, oh, that's the front card. Oh, wait, sorry. This was last year's herb bed. Mint. Some oregano. This is some new stuff. We got some cilantro there. We got that for free. Uh, sage. Bee balm. I think that's more oregano. I don't know what that is. Looks like oregano. No idea. Okay, I uh, didn't plant near as many tomatoes as I had. Uh, the total counts 39 of the 98 or whatever. Uh, ended up giving a whole lot away uh, of the plants. So, uh, so it left me with 39, but I planted the ones that I really wanted. Uh, the majority of these are romas. Well, I say the majority. Uh, the majority of two rows are romas. I got some celebrities, big boys, one sweet 100, some lemon boys, some German queens, uh, a couple that I'm growing from seed of uh, Tennessee as a local county, Granger County, that's famous for their tomatoes, and uh, I saved some seeds from those tomatoes, and that's what. Let's see, this one, this one, this one, and this one are just the seeds from those tomatoes. Uh, early girl, but uh, the majority from here out, I don't know, what is that? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18 Ramas. I uh, still have plenty left over. But I think those are going to the mother-in-law. Uh, onion and garlic. Looking awesome. The new onions. Would look a whole lot better if it had landscaping fabric. Cucumbers. I'm using fencing for them. Uh, they're looking good. Might need to thin these out a little bit. Peppers. Uh, what is that? Six bell peppers here. 
and 12 jalapenos. Hopefully, like the jalapeno. See my help here. Stupid garden cat. But check out these potatoes. Um, check out the blackberries here. Uh, they're flowering. And uh, I guess we're having blackberry winter because it's supposed to get cold in the next couple of days. <coughs> but uh, they are in full bloom. Beautiful. That's good. Here's the grapes. Now, last year was the first year we actually saw any fruit. Of course the birds didn't let us have any, but this year, I don't know if we'll be able to tell that, but uh, there's fruit all over it, well, what I imagine is going to become fruit, it's everywhere, so, uh, so hopefully we'll have a, uh, at least get to taste it. Here's a uh, rose bush that I uh, moved, and uh, it was where the water jug fits, and it was really doing pretty sad. I don't know if it just wasn't getting light. Obviously, the water jug wasn't there then, but uh, when we first moved in, it did really well. Some of the most beautiful roses, but uh, for the past couple years, it just didn't do very well. So I moved it over here, and uh, it's it's coming on. It's uh, it's looking a little sad, but uh, but it'll survive. It'll do good. I don't know if this year we'll get anything really pretty off of it, but uh, uh, hopefully it'll do well. And I fertilized it with dog poop. <laughs> There's dog poop from uh, all around it. So. Uh, so it's been fertilized pretty well, or it will as that breaks down. But uh, that's where we're at.